Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to create some basic shapes. We're going to do loft first, click part design. And now I'm going to go to Sketcher. And we're going to click that. We're going to change it to 10 millimeters and draw a very basic circle. Okay, then close it. Then next, we're going to go to part design. And we're going to go, oh no, not part, I clicked wrong. Okay, we're going to go to part design. I'm gonna click sketch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a centered rectangle. And then we're gonna get into the center, align it perfectly up. And there, okay. Now I'm gonna loft this. So yeah, I'm gonna change this object to the circle. And then we're gonna make that. Yeah, you've got a simple loft object. And it works, so, um, you know, you can just view it from around the area. Okay. Okay, I'm going to delete that. I'm going to delete that and the sketch outside. Okay. Next, we're going to go back into sketch. Yeah. I'm going to change our view. And we're going to go back into sketch and make a small rectangle. And next, we're going to go there oh, this keeps happening to me i don't know why but okay and now we're just gonna make a extremely simple it's like a path it's kind of like a path to what you're doing so i'm going to use a bezier curve or curve there click escape and there we've got a simple curve next we're gonna click sweep when i use our first sketch click ok click that we need to there now as you can see it sweeps are uh, sweeps along the axis which is kind of neat if you're trying to do like very intricate shapes okay let's delete those and okay i'm gonna show you that again delete that and delete those those two okay we're not gonna delete those two okay next what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a chamfer. So we're gonna extrude it out or we're gonna make a simple square and extrude it out. So we'll make it like 20 or 30. Yeah, just make it dirty. Um, okay, click okay. Now we're gonna get the top and click chamfer. Now this one has sharp edges and like, you know it's a bit sharp it's it's not a bevel because you know it's angled like that okay we're gonna click cancel i'm gonna go back i'm gonna use click bevel now if we let's increase the bevel and as you can see the bevel is a rounder like more round and you know less hazardous way of doing it so that's mostly now we're going to do some we're going to do draft so that's this one and what this does is kind of like tape taper angle but it does it in work one uh, like one area and look it's facing this way as you can see okay and then after that we're going to do pocket so it's that's pretty simple that's basically what's going on then we'll make an inter we can make it go thickness inwards. We can make thickness inwards, which I'm gonna do. Second. Uh, there. And as you can see. Bye guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to like, share, and share. And please support me by hitting that subscribe button. I work hard on these videos. Bye!